that we must take drastic steps to prevent the planet from reaching 1.5 degrees Celsius of warming over pre-industrial levels. Otherwise, the planet will fall into catastrophe. In reality, the 1.5 degree tipping point was an arbitrary temperature choice picked by politicians. There is no basis in science for thinking that if the temperature is reached, disaster will occur. In fact, data show that the Earth has likely already exceeded the 1.5 degree Celsius range, with no evidence indicating that we have tipped the planet into an existential crisis. The commonly cited 1.5 degrees warming threshold was not something established through any kind of rigorous scientific investigation. It's arbitrary and political. In the 1990s, an 11-member German advisory board comprised of just a single meteorologist and a variety of academics from other fields held a workshop where they came up with their own idea of the ideal temperature window for humanity. It was a thought experiment, not backed by hard science. They claimed their first guiding principle was to preserve creation in its present form, which is obviously impossible. Historically, huge climate shifts have occurred, driven by atmospheric, cosmic, and even geological factors well outside of our meager ability to influence it, much less control it. Change is the norm for the Earth, not stasis. The Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change adopted the German Advisory Board's suggestions for the ideal temperature, despite it clashing with fundamental knowledge about the way that the Earth works. European records show that temperatures actually started rising around 1890. Data from the longest continuously running temperature network in the world indicates that Europe has already exceeded a two degrees Celsius temperature rise, and there have been no cascading disasters as predicted and promoted by the media. There is no real world data that indicates global average temperatures passing that arbitrary threshold will lead to dangerous tipping points. Despite the recent rise in temperatures, weather extremes haven't worsened, hunger and poverty have declined, and lifespans have increased. <laughs>